All right, welcome to my Herald Page 2 Challenge Guide. So if you need help on page 1, I did do a guide on all of these. They're pretty easy. However, page 2 is a different story. So there's five challenges. And like I said, these are much more difficult than the first page. The first page can all be done in Team Rumble. So the challenge for the actual skin style says land at Herald Sanctum and place top 10. So obviously you can't do that in Team Rumble. Likewise, this one says deliver the Herald's warning. You actually have to talk to an NPC, which don't spawn in Team Rumble. Then we have to eliminate opponents at airborne locations. You could do this in Team Rumble. Get chromified while driving. I'm not really sure if I understand this one. You literally have to drive into a chrome tornado, or can you be chrome and chrome the vehicle and then just start driving? I don't know, we're gonna have to see. And then lastly, it says destroy objects with the explosive goo gun. That should be easy. And you can do that one in Team Rumble. So some of these you still can do, but the other ones you have to go into actual game modes like solos, duos, trios. So I'm actually going to start in Team Rumble just so we can try to do at least some of these. And then we'll do actual solo matches for the rest. So it does show all the airborne locations. Let's see if the circle favors one of these because that would be amazing. In Team Rumble, if you could get the circle to land on one of these, It'd be so easy. You only need seven limbs. And we got it. Absolutely nailed it right here. Let's go. Ah, here's a vehicle. So let's see. Let's swap to the passenger seat and chrome ourselves. Oh, yeah. Okay. So I guess the wording's just weird. So that was easy. Easy peasy. All right, so let's eliminate seven people at airborne locations. Okay. Let's see if you actually have to be up top. I'll try to get a limb on the ground and see if just being in this area counts. Are we having a duel over here? Sorry, right, but I need a limb, sir. Heck yeah. Come on, reload! These are not counting, so maybe you do have to be up top. Okay, I see a guy right there. Let's see if we can get a limb. Oh, there's two of them. Did that count? Did that count? Why are these not counting? At airborne, do I have to be on top of the blimp? I don't get it. Maybe this one actually counted, and I... Let's try, let's see if we can get up here. Of course now I can't find anybody. Oh, there is somebody. Yes! Okay, so that one did count. Shoot. Alright, we pretty much have the same circle as last game. So this time we know where to go. We're going to go on top. Not the gas station, but the actual floating platform right here. Yeah! Conan O'Brien! Oh, there's one. <gasps> Crap, I just fell all the way down. Oh, there's no way I can hit that guy from this far. Oh, wait, there. Yes! I'm running out of ammo, though. There he is. Wait, is that a chicken or a guy? Oh, it's a guy! There's someone. Yes! He was one shot! How about this guy? I can't aim from that far. Oh, here we go. Dark City is coming my way. Yes! One shot again! I need one more! How about this? Is this gun any good? Come on, I just need one more limb. Here we go. Oh, 49! Oh, I see him peeking there. Here we go. Yes, it is pretty good. Come on, buddy. Just need to... 
<gasps> Jeez, bro. Who did that? No! That guy's still right there. I gotta get him. I gotta get him. Oh no, he's won! Yes! No! Why didn't it count? Because I'm not up high enough? No! Can I be up here, maybe? Crap, there he is! Wait. He died? Darn it! That was dumb. Like, why didn't that count? Uh, we did good, though. We got a lot of them. Yes! Come on! Yes, we did it! Hey, Luke! Oh, man, Luke, chill, chill, Luke, chill! Alright. We did it, though. So, this one... Destroy objects with the explosive goo gun. We're going to do a test and see if something works. So this is a trick I did with the fire challenge where you had to ignite structures. Will it still work? I don't know. Let me show you how to do it. Okay, I don't know how many we're at, but coming down here and then destroying the base should count. So we got a pretty good amount up there. Let's destroy this with the goo gun and see if it counts all of them. Or does that just count as one? Two. Two? Oh, wow. Okay, so that did not count. Okay, that's unfortunate. So you're just going to have to blast the whole area. Wait. So that went to 16. That's pretty good. Again, I just... Oh, it's almost time. I got to do this quick. Oh no, my team's getting so many kills. There we go. Oh wow, we got it at the buzzer. Thank goodness, my team was rolling. There we go. So now we have two challenges left. Land at Herald's Sanctum and place top 10, and talk with characters and deliver the Herald's warning. So this is probably going to be an extremely difficult challenge. I'm assuming a billion people are going to land here because it's still fresh, and it's going to be difficult. Let's see though. It's got the Guaco NPC marked. We gotta talk with three characters. Maybe it'll rotate to another one after this. That's what I'm assuming. Chances are, though, I'm gonna get clapped and lose my crown. Just, what the heck? Just because I'm trying to do this challenge. And like I said, they do not spawn in Team Rumble. I guess you could do it in Arena. And here we go. Yep, look at all these people. And you know someone's gonna accidentally trigger the NPC or kill him. Then it's game over. Will some of these people be nice? Probably not. Actually, nobody's landing here. All right. So he's right here. Deliver the Herald's warning. I have time for threats. What? Oh, jeez. I was gonna say I didn't. I didn't touch him. Why did he get all mad at me? Okay, so that was easy. Let's get this rain up here. Jeez, got a shotgun. Oh my goodness. All right, what do we have to do now? It doesn't show me anywhere else to go. Maybe I have to do it in another match? Maybe I have to talk to him again. Here, come in here, sir. No, there's no other... No other option. But what the heck? Okay, so if we can find a launch pad, we can actually go to the Herald Sanctum and land there and have this still count, even though we didn't originally land there. So let's see if we can find a launch pad. I'll prove that that actually works. So we'd have to place it near the Herald Sanctum, use the launch pad, land there, and it should count. 
Is it? Is it? It is! Let's go! Yeah, so obviously you want to get some height so you actually land at the Herald Sanctum. Alright, here we go. Herald Sanctum. Let me make sure we touch down safely. And right here. Boop! Oh yeah, see? It counted. Now we just got to place top 10. And we're very close as it is. So we'll just make a little quarter bunker here. And we're going to hide. Now I do have a bounty on my face, like I said, so I am a little nervous, but... Someone's healing, like, right next to me. And we only need eight more people to bite the dust. And we've got it. One more person. Come on. Yeah, we did it. Nice. So that did work. Easiest way to do that, if you don't land at the Herald Sanctum to begin with, get a launch pad or use probably the tornado. That'll likely work as well. And then just camp it out. What in the world? Where did that guy come from? The 1v1v1. I don't know. I have no idea where this guy is. This is so dumb. Like, I cannot find this guy. He's hiding like a sissy Barbie girl. Fine. We'll wait. Boy, it says he's swimming down here. Be a bot. I almost died. I mean, that wasn't a bot. That was a real player. But I almost died there. Jeez, Louise. Oh, we kept our crown at least. Let's go. Twenty-nine. Okay, so I don't know if you can go to any NPC, but I looked a few videos up online, and everyone's saying to go to this NPC right here, and then go to the one at Sunny Steps right here. So those are pretty close to each other. So we'll try that. That's two more, and that will complete the final challenge. I don't see anyone landing here, so that's a plus. We'll go straight up and talk to Miss Evie. Deliver the Herald's warning. So this is how it happens. I need to send a transmission. You can send me this Shadow Tracker, Miss. Thanks very much. I foresaw this coming. I am prepared. Did it work? There we go. We're done. Let's go. There's the loading screen. And all quests completed. So there you go. That was page two. Like I said at the start, a little more difficult. This one took me one hour and 34 minutes to do, as opposed to, I don't know, 20 minutes for this first page. So much more time consuming, a little more difficult. Not too bad, but like I said, it does take some time. So there you go. I'll do a full gameplay and review on the Herald later. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaperTime.